Um, hello, Natasha, and um, I'd like to say thank you for allowing me to do another um, demo of my calendars, custom calendars and diaries. So my brother and I, and we came up with this concept which I told you about. Um, you know, we love personalization with print. We, we think it's the future for our industry and uh, we, we really enjoy doing it. So what I'm going to show you today is um, customization of your calendar with using your artwork that you use for your gift cards, which I already have shown you today. Um, so I'll, I'll keep it short and sweet and uh, we'll, we'll take it. We'll kick off from now. So basically, uh, this is where we would like to um, uh, guide your customer to. Um, this is where we would recommend taking the customer so the so it bypasses all the other brands that we deal with. So basically, they come straight into Baptist World as the product card, and they can see that brand, the branding is nice and strong. Um, and um, for them to basically select and move forward to create their own calendar. So. Um, over here is just a, a semi little preview of uh, what the calendar is going to look like. A um, bit of a taste test for them, uh, just to see um, some really beautiful artwork. A uh, few few paragraphs just outlining how much of a useful tool a calendar can be, and especially a, a customized one, and some um, you know some wording about the artwork as well, explaining um, all of that as well. Um, over here is the price. Um, uh, I won't present any costings um, in this um, demo at all um, because there's several sales streams that you could have with my calendars uh, you corporate gifting um, charities um, um, brand selling um, the calendar as another branded product um, to create revenue um, and you know that's there's multiple over here you can order quantity um, you know, uh, up to one, up to whatever quantity you wish. A3 portrait. We have done some case studies and a fair bit of uh, research, and the old um, A3 uh, portrait fits well uh, in most walls. We'll be finishing it with a beautiful Waro with a Mexican hat up the top there. Um, and over here, starting month, um, we, we can change this. And we, uh, we put this option in here. Uh, because of um, accountants using it as tools where they can start off their financial year and head out, hand out their calendars, their financial calendars in July. So once you've read, read this page and you've seen this page, uh, we're going to basically go straight into the edit, editor, into the builder, by pressing the button to start creating. So as you can see, uh, Basically, the, the, the calendar is all preloaded with all hero shot, shots of the brand, him, hero imagery, um, all the way to the back cover, outlining um, you know, all the months from January through to December. Over here on your left-hand side, you can have the option if you wanted to have some more hero shots of the brand, uh, to just basically uploading more into there. Um, so this is um, determined, you know, when we're basically doing the creation for you uh, and how many images that you'd like to supply us. Uh, we're recommending um, uh, to a lot of brands that we have obviously your 12 hero shots and then you have another 12 over here to swap and change. You don't have to have this option. You can have the straight 12. Um, the other options that you have regarding imagery, you can basically upload my own photos. Uh, through Facebook, Insta, or you know, your photos on your computer, but we can remove that as well, which is no problem at all. Once you're happy with the imagery, the 12 pictures that you've selected, uh, basically um, it's time to start creating the personalization of your special events, the dates. So the tools over here on your right hand side of the screen uh, are your editing tools to be able to, to put uh, events and special dates within your uh, within the calendar. So these can be removed to make it uh, uh, less confusing and it's not that hard, but it, we can remove a few of them. The most important one that we'll be using, uh, a lot of clients will be using, is obviously your events page um, tool. So, so from here, it's a 
It's very simple. It's just filling in the fields of Daniel's birthday. Make that June one, perfect. Um, I'm going to add again. anniversary for three one and you just continue um, inputting your, your special, uh, special event dates within this field and once you've completed that um, it's going to populate in the areas that you've selected so as you can see that I'm pretty sure that was mum and dad's anniversary right there and the other one was in June I think Yes, Daniel's birthday. It was right there. So once you've done that and you've completed the personalized customization of your own calendar, uh, it's obviously time to basically go to the shopping cart, the checkout stage, um, to put in the, the final information of your address um, to basically send the calendar off to. Uh, so from here, it's going to take you into a cart where I've got several items that I've um, put in there before. Uh, I did one earlier on as you can see. Um, and there's a couple other here from Thermomix. Uh, so from here it's a, chimp uh, it's a simple checkout procedure. Uh, we have discount codes. So um, you know, for vouchers, um, as if, if it's a corporate gift you can have a voucher number in here to submit it to create the sale. Once the sale is done, um, either through um, the receiving of checkout, a confirmation of order, will go to Baptist Church, um, and then a confirmation of order and manufacturing will go to my calendar. Um, from that stage, we'll create, um, we will um, uh, print and, and bind and package and send. Uh, we will roughly um, turn around to uh, on the calendar. We'll roughly be about three days. Um, you should be receiving it, um, and that's pretty much it. To basically, to for us to create your site, uh, if you wanted to move forward for this year, no problem whatsoever. Uh, basically, once you've got your imagery together and your um, special information that we spoke about, Natasha, uh, you could have different kinds of calendars for the different um, categories of donators, um, donors. I don't know. Sorry. Um, you could. Uh, we could. We could have a. Once we've got all the informa information imagery, we could have this up and running within uh, forty-eight hours. We'd be at it ready to go live once you've approved it. Um, so it's not that hard on our back end at all. Um, that's um, that's all for today. I'd like to say thank you for your time. Hope I didn't take too much up. And um, uh, we'll talk soon, Natasha. Thank you very much. Um, have a wonderful afternoon. Thank you.